Welcome back to Zoologist, where we explore the wonders of wildlife and share tips on how to care for our feathered friends. Today we're diving into a fascinating topic, what do baby hummingbirds eat? If you've ever been lucky enough to encounter these tiny jewels, or are just curious about their early life, this guide is for you. Let's flutter into the world of baby hummingbirds and discover how to support their growth and health. Ready? Let's take off. First up, let's talk about baby hummingbirds, also known as chicks. These tiny creatures are incredibly delicate and have specific nutritional needs that are crucial for their survival and development. From the moment they hatch until they're ready to leave the nest, every meal counts. So what exactly do these tiny flyers eat? Let's zoom in. In the wild, baby hummingbirds rely entirely on their mother for food. The mother hummingbird is a diligent provider, making up to hundreds of trips each day to feed her chicks. She brings back a mix of nectar and insects, ensuring her babies get a balanced diet of sugars for energy and proteins for growth. Baby hummingbirds eat a diet primarily composed of regurgitated insects and nectar provided by their mother. This high-protein diet is essential for their rapid growth. Insects like gnats, spiders and aphids provide the necessary amino acids, while nectar offers vital sugars. If you ever find yourself caring for an orphaned or rescued baby hummingbird, it's crucial to mimic this natural diet as closely as possible. A mixture of specialized hummingbird nectar and a protein supplement designed for baby birds can be used. Feeding requires a tiny syringe or dropper, and it's a delicate process that should ideally be overseen by wildlife rehabilitation experts. Feeding technique is vital. The goal is to allow the chick to lap up the food from the tip of the feeder, simulating how it would feed from its mother's beak. Overfeeding or improper feeding can lead to health issues, so if you're inexperienced, seeking guidance from a professional is essential. As baby hummingbirds grow and prepare to leave the nest, they'll start to practice flying and feeding from flowers and feeders. If you're rehabilitating a hummingbird, introducing a feeder to the enclosure can help ease this transition. Watching a baby hummingbird take its first flight is a rewarding experience, symbolizing the culmination of your care and efforts. Caring for baby hummingbirds is a profound responsibility filled with challenges but also incredible rewards. These tiny birds with their insatiable appetite for life remind us of the resilience of nature and the impact of our compassionate care. Remember, if you find a baby hummingbird in need, contacting a wildlife rehabilitation center is the best first step. If you've enjoyed this journey into the lives of baby hummingbirds, please hit that subscribe button and share this video with fellow nature lovers. Your support helps us bring more wildlife wonders to light. Drop your thoughts and experiences in the comments below, we'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching and see you in the next adventure.